Welcome back and happy Valentine's Day. I'm so glad you're here. I am Coach Julia and today I have a special guest, my sister Abigail with me. Thanks for coming. Of course, this will be fun. We are going to have some fun today. I'm excited. So today, in honor of Valentine's Day, we are going to be showing you some moves you can do with a partner. Some baby pair skating moves. So, you know, bring your sweetheart out, your best friend, your sister, and you can have some fun out on the ice with us. Now, we're gonna do a spin, a jump, and a gliding maneuver. And as always, I will give you any uh, tutorial links below if you're gonna need those to do this maneuver. The first thing we're gonna do is that pair spin. Oh my gosh, you're gonna love this. So you're gonna need to be able to do a half swizzle, which I'll link that below, and an inside spread eagle for this maneuver. So work on those if you need to, and then come back. All right, so to start, we're gonna put our hands together like we're gonna arm wrestle, all right? So our thumbs are locking, and then our hands wrap around each other's hand. So that good arm wrestling position. And then we're gonna put our shoulders so that we're in line with each other, all right? You can see we're lined up in a nice line there. And you wanna keep that nice and strong. You don't wanna have sloppy arms or you're gonna spin out of control, and that's not fun. <laughs> okay, so the, to start, we're doing that half swizzle. I'm gonna use my left leg. You're gonna use your left leg. We're both pumping around in a circle like this. So practice that all on its own first, trying to keep that line, those shoulders really lined up with each other. <laughs> hey. <laughs> okay, now once you can do that and one person isn't pulling the other person and you're not losing control, then we can get to the spin part. And this is where you're going to have to have some good abs, right? It needs some ab control. <laughs> okay, so thumbs, pumping, and then we're going to turn towards each other, open into that spread eagle, and get that same hand position with the other hand. So your hands are crossed in the middle. All right, so once you can do that spin, you've got that hand hold, you're in your spread eagle, now it's time to increase the speed. So when you're holding hands in that spread eagle position, you wanna have that really tall torso, strong body, engage those glutes, and then you're just gonna squeeze those hands in towards each other. You don't wanna get hunched back here, okay? And then you're like in each other's face. Well, maybe if you're doing it with your sweetheart, you wanna do that. But for most of us, we wanna keep our bodies really strong and tall and engaged, and then we're just gonna pull those hands in towards each other and when you're spinning you're actually going to increase your speed so let's give that a try so we're going to pump hands and pull those hands in <laughs> For our next move, you're gonna want a waltz jump. So go ahead and find the waltz jump tutorial linked down below. And you're gonna need to be able to do a two foot turn from backwards to forwards, so where your toes lift over, all right? So those are the two skills you're gonna need for this. So we're starting with our hands the same as the spin. So we're gonna cross opposite hands. Now, this is gonna have a little pull. So one person is just doing the waltz jump and you're gonna jump around the other person. All right, so it's not a big, long jump. You're jumping around. You wanna go around me? All right, so make your jump very circular. The supporting person is at the same time gonna do a two foot turn and your hands are gonna pull a little bit back. So you're keeping those really strong biceps and you're gonna just pull those arms a little bit and it gives your partner a big lift. All right, <laughs> it's very simple, but you gotta be careful because I don't wanna hurt my partner here, right? So it's the responsibility of the person who's doing the lifting to be careful with their partner so they don't get hurt. <laughs> okay, do you wanna jump first or do you wanna support first? I will jump first. Okay, so you go on this side of me. All right. So we're gonna get those arm wrestling hands crisscrossed and Abigail is gonna jump around me. 
while I'm on two feet, and then I'm gonna jump around her while she's on two feet. Jump, 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 jump. So this move is very simple. It just is gonna take a little bit of practice. And when you really go all out and really pull, man, these jumps fly. <laughs> so we're gonna do it one more time, all out. Yes. You ready? Oh, I'm ready, I'm excited. <laughs> <laughs> okay, arm wrestling hand and go for it. One more. <laughs> <Ta -da! laughs> this one is by far, I think, the simplest. We're gonna do partner forward spirals. So if you have a forward spiral in a straight line, you can do this maneuver. Otherwise, check that tutorial down below. So for this one, I'm going to be the traditionally male or supporting partner and she's the traditionally female or following partner. Well, all that means, and it doesn't really matter, but all that means is I'm going to be holding her hand and holding her on the side by the hip, which normally the guy does, but you can mix it up. <laughs> all right. Okay. So all we're going to do is some forward skating, trying to synchronize those feet together. So we're trying to push at the same time. Okay. Look at us, we're so good. <laughs> and then when you're ready, you're gonna put your feet together and we're both gonna lift our right leg. So nice. <laughs> so this one, again, really simple, but you need to make sure you're supporting your own spiral. You cannot rely on your partner to hold your spiral up because it's very likely they're not prepared for that and you could both go down and we want to avoid injuries whenever possible so hold your own spiral the other thing we're trying to do is make our lines as similar as possible so that means the person in the back me <laughs> this time usually has to lift my leg a little higher so that it mimics my partner's spiral but maybe we should do it the other way around and you should do my job. Ooh. We try that? <laughs> sure. Okay, so she's gonna hold my hand, hold my side. We're just gonna skate forward together. Push, push, push when we're ready. Now I'm gonna hold my leg, my arm out straight. That means her arm's gonna be bent, but it gives us a really strong uh, support if my arm is straight. Okay, so the partner in front, which whichever that one is, wants to have a really straight arm. All right, that, that gives some stability there. Yes. All right, should we show them the harder version? Yes. Okay, <laughs> the harder spiral is called a star spiral. And we are gonna be making the shape of our star with our two spirals joined. So she is gonna be doing a forward spiral. I am gonna be doing a backward spiral. So we're gonna be skating down the ice doesn't really matter how you skate, just some pushes, some crossovers, whatever you feel comfortable with. But then we're gonna cross hands. So I'm using my right, she's using her left. No, we're both using our rights. <laughs> we're both using our rights. And we're gonna put that up over our heads. So that's the point of the star, all right? And then since we're both in a spiral, those are the side points of the star. Can you put your leg up for me? And we're gonna hold on to each other's leg in the back. Now again, don't count on your partner to support your spiral. You have to hold your own spiral, otherwise we're gonna be in trouble. Yes. <laughs> All right, I know it sounds a little complicated, but it's super cool if you can pull it off. All right, let's give this a try, ready? So we're just gonna get some speed. You ready? Mm -hmm. Okay, cross hands up over your head and reach for those arms. And there's your star spiral. If you're interested in doing uh, partner competitions or shows, this is a really, really cool move to put in there. It's very unique. It's not as hard as it looks, and it gets a big payoff from your audience. 
Okay, skaters, I hope you enjoyed this. Go out, enjoy this Valentine's Day, and then spend some fun with a partner mm -hmm. out on the ice trying these partner moves. Thank you so much for joining me today. Thank you for having me. This was a lot of fun. <laughs> so much fun. If you enjoyed this, please do give us that thumbs up. And as always, I look forward to reading all your comments in the section down below. If you haven't done so yet, hit that subscribe button and the little notification bell down in the corner so you can see all my videos when they come out. Happy skating, and I'll see you next time.